The Windwards Volcanoes overcame a century from Jeremy Solozano and conceding first innings to TNT to force their way back into contention on day two of their West Indies Championship match with Trinidad and Tobago at the Brian Lara Academy in Taruba. Ruskin Mark has more on a splendid effort from Solozano. Resuming at his overnight 46 not out, Jeremy Solozano pushed on towards a splendid century, his second in regional cricket to go along with his 110 scored against Guyana. He picked his spots along the way and took what the bowlers gave him. He went past his 50 but didn't slow down. He and Jangu kept the windwards attack at bay, even though they weren't scoring too heavily in the morning session. But like TNT on day one, when Imran Khan claimed career best 7 for 47, Shane Schillingford, a former windward skipper, took his cue from that and claimed six wickets as the Red Force were restricted to 225, a slim lead of just 19 runs. Salazano reached 104 with nine boundaries, even as the carnage continued at the other end. Trailing by 19 runs, the windwards didn't blink, and openers Roland Cato, 81 not out, and Tariq Gabriel, 58, added 148 before being separated and closed on 167 for one, a lead already of 148 runs entering day three. Ruskin Mark, TDT Sports.